First, take out of all items from the package. There are monitor, camera, bracket, power cord, cigarette adapter, antenna and T-taps. Follow my operation. Install the antenna on the monitor. Pick up the bracket. Loosen the screws. Align the bracket with the holes on the back of the monitor and slide it in. Tighten the screws. Tear off the protective film at the bottom of the bracket. You can paste it on the dashboard or windshield. Paste it where you want and pull down the buckle. After adjusting the angle, tighten the screws. power cord to the monitor. Connect another power cord to the camera. Follow my operation. Use a tool to cut off the outside. Please be careful not to cut the copper wire inside. Follow my operation. Now merge the two thin red wires. Then merge two thin black wires. Take out the green connector. Use a tool to loosen the screw. Plus is positive, minus is negative. Insert the merged red wire into the positive, plus slot of the green connector. Tighten the screw. Insert the merged black wire into the minus, slot of the green connector. Tighten the screw. Please don't let the positive and negative electrodes touch. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the green connector. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the power outlet. Press the red button. The red button lights up. The monitor lights up and the image appears on the screen. The testing finished. Now disconnected all the wires. Follow my operation. Touch the M key to enter the menu mode. The first icon is used for pairing signal. Touch the OK key to enter the pairing countdown. Turn off the camera's power and quickly turn on. The image appears on the screen, indicating that the pairing is successful. The easiest way is connect the monitor to cigarette lighter outlet. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the power outlet. Press the red button. The red button lights up. The monitor lights up and the screen shows no signal. When the monitor has no image, the monitor is black. Touch the M key, the screen lights up. Take out the license plate. Align the camera hole with the license plate hole. Use screws to fix the camera and license plate. You can also install the camera in front of the license plate. Use screws to fix the camera and license plate. The red wire is connected to the positive wire of the tail light, reverse light or license plate light. The black wire is connected to the negative of the tail light, reverse light or license plate light. Please note, the color of the positive and negative poles of the vehicle may be inconsistent. Please use the tool to test in advance. The image appear on the screen. Now introduce the function of the monitor. The up key has no effect in this case. Touch the M key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down key to switch to the picture. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the OK key. The icon turns red. Touch the up or down key to adjust the brightness. Touch the OK key to confirm. The icon turns yellow. Touch the up or down key to switch to the contrast. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to adjust the contrast. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the hue. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to adjust the hue. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the M key to return to the previous interface. Touch the up or down key to switch to the mirror flip. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to select the mode you need. 
touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the system. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the OK key. The icon turns red. Touch the up or down key to select the language you need. Touch the OK key to confirm. The icon turns yellow. Touch the up or down key to switch to the DELAYTIME. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to adjust the DELAYTIME. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the SCANTIME. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to adjust the SCANTIME. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the auto scan. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to turn on the auto scan. Touch the OK key to confirm. The scan appear on the screen. Touches the M key to quit the menu mode. The monitor automatically switches the camera channel. Touch the M key to enter the menu mode. Touch the up or down key to switch to the system. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to switch to the auto scan. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the up or down key to turn off the auto scan. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touches the M key to quit the menu mode. The scan not appear on the screen. The monitor can't automatically switches the camera channel. The down key has no effect in this case. Touch the fourth key. The H appear on the screen. Touch the up or down key to adjust the height of the guidelines. Touch the fourth key. The W appear on the screen. Touch the up or down key to adjust the width of the guidelines. Touch the fourth key. The M appear on the screen. Touch the up or down key to moving the guidelines right or left. Touch the fourth key to turn off the guideline. Touch the fourth key again to turn on the guideline. Touch the OK key to switch to the CAM2 channel. Touch the OK key again to switch to the split mode. Touch the OK key again to switch to the CAM1 channel. Pick up the second camera. Install the antenna on the second camera. Connect the power cord to the second camera. The red wire is connected to the positive wire of the tail light, reverse light or license plate light. The black wire is connected to the negative of the tail light, reverse light or license plate light. Please note, the color of the positive and negative poles of the vehicle may be inconsistent. Please use the tool to test in advance. Touch the OK key to switch to the CAM2 channel. Touch the M key to enter the menu mode. Touch the OK key to enter the pairing countdown. Turn off the camera's power and quickly turn on. The image appears on the screen, indicating that the pairing is successful. Touch the OK key to switch to the split mode. Images on both channels. The process of connecting the camera to the lamp line. T-taps. T-taps has two holes and one hole is closed. The long line is the line of the lamp or the circuit line on the car. Thrust the car light line into the first hole. camera power cord. Plug the power cord into the second hole. 
iron sheets. Clamp the iron sheet to the tap's bottom 